Hello, folks, and welcome back to Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Here in front of the gloomy, gloomy, gloomy forest, there's got to be a way inside of it. I wonder if we actually need to... Okay. Military training camp. That That's why that's all messed up. We can't go inside of it. Okay, so every, we tried going this way, and we failed. Like, as soon as we went through the path, we just shuddered, and that was it. There's got to be a way to do that, but I don't know. I don't know. Um, let's go to other places. We'll figure out the Lost Woods. The, yeah, we'll figure out the Lost Woods later. Okay, so there's a shrine there, apparently. And then also a Gliok. Uh, if I go here, that should take me over to that shrine. Let's go over here and go north. Assume, of course, that is a shrine is what I marked, but that's usually what I mark off as shrines. Kind of means we're going to be going all over the place, but we just need shrines. That's all we really need. Because that'll give us more hearts and more stam. Already started getting our third wheel, but it's gonna be a ways till we get there. And actually, at that on that screen, that did not look like a fourth of the way. That was like maybe like a tenth of the way. Hopefully, that's not right. This is north, right? Oh, okay, north is this way. Yes. Okay. And Shrine is way off in the distance somehow. I don't know how I saw that before, but okay. Let's be nice and circumspect here. I'm probably going to need to kill that Arakula, but we'll see. He's got a Lizardos on him for some reason. How did I even see this Shrine from here? It must not have been from here. It must have been from another place. I don't know where, though. Theoretically, I should see it. I mean, maybe it's like down here somewhere. No. I have no idea where the marker is now. It's very strange. I see a glinting light over there. It looks like a maybe a researcher fire. Do not see anything resembling a shrine down this way, though. So it could be the rains including it. Oh, there's a falling rock. Maybe that'll help. Maybe that'll help. Let's drop. Okay, so I can pull. I can go up five with a falling rock. Is there anything? How's the marker at? Did I lose the marker? Okay, the marker is behind me, apparently. I don't see how, but okay. Fortunately, we have the rock here to regain our altitude. Yeah, I don't see where... Where the hell am I supposed to be looking? Okay, look over that way. Okay. Supposed to be just dry dive off here. Okay, it's supposed to be down this way. Directly in front of me, supposedly. Okay, I don't see anything there now, but oh maybe the, the hell is that? Oh, it's a Lionel. Why did I mark a Lionel? Uh, I don't even know what kind that is. What kind of Lionel is that? Apparently, I marked a Lionel with a beacon rather than a mark, so let's edit that pin. Um, let's go with star. Lionels deserve stars, I think. I have no idea if I can take this guy, but I guess it's worth a shot. Oh, you're so gonna die. Alright. Alright. Hey, Lionel. What's up? Okay, you got me. Holy 
freaking hell, he just took me out. I just died right now. That's what just happened. Okay. Need to dodge more. I need to get, like, on him, I think. Oh, Jimmy freaking Christmas. Okay, now I need to dodge more. I need to dodge. Now, you know what I need to do? I need to, like, muddle butt or something. Hold on. I need a, a bow. Any bow will do. Doesn't actually matter, so I don't really care about the damage. It's puff sure, that's what I mean. Oh, okay, or just die again. I guess I could do that too. Yep, wrong puff shroom, wrong obligation. Oh, nope, that didn't work either. He just ran me down. Okay, well, he missed me that time. Can I mount you? No, I can only do that with your sprints. Wow, I don't really have the right weapon for this, do I? Okay, somehow he missed me. Yeah, he is very strong. This is the wrong Lionel to fight me or fight right now. Forest, so much for the Forest Roller Spear. I wasn't really expecting that too much. Anyway, let's do something a little more... Oomph. No, freaking Christmas. Yeah, I think he's just gonna kill me. I can burn through all my food here, but I think he's just gonna kill me. Okay, and he's gonna charge me here. Oh no, he's gonna breathe fire. Okay. And it's broken. Well, at least it didn't hit me that time. It's something. We do have a 54 here. Okay, somehow he missed me. I we're right behind him the entire time, but it's not... Okay, somehow I'm not dead. He just ran me over. He didn't actually get me. That time he hit me. Okay, well, yeah. All right. I don't know where the weapons take this guy out. I really don't. I burned through, I don't know how much stuff there, but that was not what we're supposed to be doing. Okay, so Lionel, I marked him with the wrong tab, I guess. That's like a silver Lionel, too. Like, that is not easy. Uh, okay, don't. Should I take a picture of him? White mane. So not even silver, but he is white mane. We've never taken a picture of him before. Yeah, save her to take a picture from the back. Okay, so that is not where I want to be right now. Used up a lot of stuff there, too. Where's my other mark? I don't even see it. There we go. There's another one here at Hyrule Ridge. So, what's going on there? I can probably do... Oh, okay. There's another Lionel there, I guess. Let's edit that to the star, because he deserves it. And... Other marks. Do I have any other marks? I have... Oh, okay. There's like four of them down here in Gerudo Valley. So it's going to get warm. That's all right. Um, sure, why not? Launch me from there. There's a Gleok right there, I guess. Is there really a Gleok that close? Let's go to the Skyview Tower. Let's see if that's actually true. I don't know if I don't have enough strength or what, but that Lionel freaking wrecked me. There's got to be some way to take that Lionel out, obviously. I just I feel like I just didn't have enough weapon power, I guess. But even with the 50, that wasn't enough. That's pretty insane. Okay, go ahead and launch me. Just got to point south. So, okay, that's a. Uh, um, okay, we don't care about the, what's up here. 
but I want those down. Okay, so that pin there to my immediate left should be, I'm guessing, a Gliok. It's got a death sign on it, so I would guess that was true, but I don't actually know. Yeah, I can't tell. There is a shrine over there. Let me go for the shrine. I don't think I've been there. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's... Okay, so there's another shrine over that way, so this is exactly where I want to go. Uh, do, can I wear my... Yeah, I'm wearing the wrong outfit for this. I need to be able to glide a little bit. Skydive mobility up a little bit. Yeah, okay, that's definitely getting some more distance. I definitely need more of this gear. This is probably all going to be in the depths, too. It's the only place we really found a lot of... Well, I guess we found some of the gear elsewhere. There are a lot of X's in the depths, but I'm guessing that's because... Uh, that's where all the... All the costumes and pieces are. You could dive in the depths from here, right? We just dive into the gloom hole there. That'll work. The trouble is that it doesn't get a shrine. Well, I guess it give, does kind of give a shrine locations. Right? Because every bright root is the underside of a shrine. So it might still be worth doing. We could probably... Yeah, if we get the locations, we'd probably be able to tell exactly where. I think that's how I got the Gerudo locations there, but I'll have to look and see. Could be I just looked and saw them. I'm not being able to find too many underground shrines, though. They're really difficult to spot. We're getting to the point where that might be the only ones left pretty soon, but we'll see. Okay, what do we got? Built to carry. All right. It's going to be carrying that ball down here somehow. I've got a nice convoluted route for me to go. This looks pretty convoluted. Um, kind of looks like I need to attach a fan to that or something, but I don't see anything I can attach here. There's no devices. Yeah, and this is just the platform to start the rail on. There's no building materials here. That's peculiar. Or whatever here. Now, if there's a ladder to work our way up to the ball... Okay, there's got to be a way to get to the ball. So I guess, can I just float over? Yeah, okay, I can float over and then we climb to the ball. Then maybe from the ball there's devices we can build on? It's the only other thing that makes sense. I don't know if I'm actually supposed to be able to do this, but they provide a ladder here. I mean, why not? Okay. Nothing to build here either. All right, so I guess we could... Probably just put the ball on the rail. Seems like that would work. Alright, let's try putting the ball on the rail. I played a little bit of Marble Madness back in the day. I think this will work out. Yeah, just go ahead and slide over there. Great. Perfect. Fantastic. Barely even rolled at all. Now, the problem over here is this looks a little bit too wide, doesn't it? This looks like the ball... Yeah, that looks like that will actually just let the ball fall right through. I guess that's what these are for. Probably, like, attach these to the ball on either side. It's, so, like, right there. And then... I don't know, over on this side. Probably doesn't actually matter, but we'll say it does. All right. Oh, nope, not not in the middle. That won't help. That won't help. I'm gonna go like over here, I guess. That's not right at all. Okay. Let me twist this around a little bit. Let me yeah, move you over, down, and maybe like here-ish. Yeah, okay. That's that's more balanced, okay. Alright, now that should work. So now we should be able to get you over this way. And yep, that'll work. That'll work. Oh no! Oh nope, not not quite. Not quite. I don't believe this. Dang, 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 dang. 
Well, at least the things came back there. The ball is going to drop down eventually. And eventually. Okay, the ball actually came back over here. That was nice of him. I really expected it to have to go all the way back up, but no, they're just going to drop it right here for me. Oh, there's more of them. There's more of the things over that way. Okay, so I wonder how we're supposed to do this. Maybe... Let's grab you. Put you like... Okay. That's actually not a bad place for you right there. That gives me a good position, I think. What do we want to do... Maybe like across here? Like a cross brace along the top? Like putting it there might be enough. I think that'll work. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's put you right here. Uh, okay, if we had to turn it all, I'd be worried. But I think this might do it. Oh, no. Okay, not quite. Not quite. Okay. So, put you right there. Take this off. Alright, so then we might need two of these then. Let's go, let's assume we need two. Let's put one there and then attach the other one directly across from it. Right there will do. Okay, let's see if that works. Up and over. This should be fine. This should work. Come on, go push you over that way. Yeah. No worries. Oh, come on. That was... The physics, man. The physics. The freaking bonks along the side somehow disrupted that. What the actual shit? Alright, so how do we deal with that? Okay, don't... I mean, I guess we could put you there. That's fine. Um... Okay, so we need some way to deal with those frickin' knockable pieces there. So what we need is like a... It's not just guidance. Okay, don't, don't move away from there. We also need to make sure we have like a corrector of some type. I guess we could do this. Kind of makes it so it'll stay on, maybe? Maybe. Let's see. Okay, it bonks a little bit side to side, but it definitely gets where we want to go, so that's good, 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 good. Okay. Now for the last bit. Well, now we've got actual carts to work with and actual pieces, so that's good. Why is this over here? Oh, because, okay. Right, we can build one to make us... Let's go over here. Uh, since the ball is safe here, so, like, this won't work, right? Not by itself. So the ball's safe here, right? It's never gonna go to the other places ever again. So we can move it over here. We can play with this a little bit. So we can say, like, you know, put this on... How's this gonna work? like a stable platform to jump off of. How is this going to work? I mean, I guess... Hold on. Put you over here. Put you... over here. So now we have, like, a... square. But trouble is it's too wide. That's going to fall off the rail, no question. need something to hold on to the rail. Um, come on, let go. Let go. Even that's too wide. Yeah, we need something much tighter. Like, maybe... Yeah, we need a separator, like, that far apart. We don't have anything like that, do we? Let's try you. Um, so we do like this. So you attach to. Okay, you're attached to the right side. And I attach you to the left side. Okay, all right, that might work. Right, that'll attach to the bar there. I won't move.
move though. It's not moving. It might be too wide. It's not mark. It's gonna mock against that. It's an interesting idea that might actually get the ball over. Yeah, I think this is the right idea to get the ball over, but it's not the right idea to get the chest. Okay. Well, at least we have a we have a plan. Uh, we should probably put the ball on it first. It's gonna have to fall over. Ah, uh, that. Hmm. No, what I need is Let's separate this thing. I need something that hangs onto the bar and then it swings the ball underneath it. That's what I need. So to hang onto the bar is probably pretty simple. Kind of like that, like something to grab onto the bar. Make it so that we don't fall too far. Kind of works. Um, the ball can maybe go on. So we want to go ahead and close this up, but not all the way. We basically want to close it up enough to be able to get the bar inside of it, but for the most part, it just sticks. Yeah, okay. So now, so we put the bar inside of this. Come on, inside, right there. And now it has no choice but to get over there. Dead simple. No problems. Yeah, that part's easy. How am I gonna get the chest? I used up all the pieces. <laughs> oh, that's the risk. Okay, well. If I could launch myself, we'd have no problems, but launching is not on the menu. All right, well, I can do the prescribed part here easy. Like, we just detach you. Get you over there. There you go. Get over the side. Yep. And then off you go. That part's simple. The building materials, I think we can drop into the abyss. And then I think they'll reappear where they need to be, where they were originally. Let's try it. Drop them into the abyss. Off you go. Whee. Yep, sure enough, they appear over the other side. Okay, great. So, we just need to make our way to the other side, but that's easy. We need that ourselves. Almost missed the button press there. That would have been really embarrassing. Okay, maybe don't do that. Oh, no, okay. We, we regain stamina on ladders. That's actually good news. Is me having these cylinders at all? I don't think so. Don't let the cylinders help me. Oh, they put cylinders over here, so maybe they are supposed to help. Oh, no, that was a cylinder from the ball, wasn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, in, that's not right. Okay. How am I going to get that? And the main thing is, the main reason why that second bar exists is so you don't build it too wide. Which I totally fell into the trap of doing. So, what do we do instead? We need to build something that grabs the bar but doesn't grab it too soon. Too much. Or too anything, really. Uh, we might be able to do... I want to go to grab the bar. So... I don't want to grab the bar. Hold on. Move that. Need to move it, like, in here, maybe? I don't know if that's going to be good enough. We can try it, but we, I don't know. I don't know about this. It might work. What I'm hoping is the piece on the left lets me jump off and also balances it, but this might just fall over. Okay, it does fall over a little bit, but it doesn't actually fall over completely for some reason. It's also not moving, which is a problem. Oh, okay. That didn't work at all. For some reason, I thought I could glide my way to the ladder. I could, could have sworn that was going to work. Oh, you know what? You know what? 
We need to build a glider way to the ladder. But we can do that if we just build up. Then I can jump and glide my way to the ladder, and then no worries. Because I can climb this stuff, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I can do that. So here. Break that off. Put it up like here. Can I climb this? Yeah, I can't climb it. Okay, if I could have climbed this, that would have worked out, but I guess only certain pieces are climbable. I think we can still do this, though. The thing is... I can't do that. But if I do... Hold on. Break you far. Push off the side. Um, maybe grab you. And put you up here. So I want to get height. Okay, give me a platform to launch off of. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna work or not. Oops, okay, can't just set it on top. It's gonna conclude. There we go. Okay. So now it's a complete item. What I'm gonna do is knock it over. Um hopefully just by doing this. So we're just gonna grab this and knock it over. Maybe. That might be too heavy. Um how about if I Unbalance it. I unbalance it, knocking it over my work. It's not unbalanced completely yet. Do I have any other pieces I can use? Got the cylinders. I need to unbalance this. I need to knock it over completely. Um. Yeah, I think over here is fine. Still not enough to knock it over. Maybe it's just too steady. Do I build too well? So I thought then I could use recall to be able to make this work, but it's not. Oh, it's almost unsteady enough. You breathe the wrong direction, it'll totally knock itself over. Um how about this part? I don't like this part. Let go. Okay, there we go. Now it's over. Now it's over. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, so. My idea is use recall here. I don't know if it's going to work. I'm hoping it works. So I can get on top of this thing at all? Okay. It's going to be tricky. Let's see if this works. No! Okay. No, 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 no. Knock yourself over again. Oh, it actually got steady, but that's actually good. This will work too. If I can climb this, that's not what I intended, but I'll make it work. Come on, we just need to just wish this wasn't a cylinder because it's going to be real hard to balance on. Come on, come on, come on. You can do it, Link. I believe in you. There we go. No, okay. Once we get on the platter pieces, it's going to be easy. Oh, okay, got the second bar. That's good. You know what? Maybe I can use this. No, no, don't. Don't recall. I'm going to use this to create, like, another slope, because I might be able to do that better. Okay, can I descend that? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Good, 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 good. Okay, now... Oh, no, don't. Don't slide off of it. Now we jump off, glide, and hit the ladder. Nope. Okay, not quite. Not quite, but on the right path, I think. Like maybe if I take this contraption closer. Like right about there. Okay. It's tilting like hell, but that's alright. Recall it. I can pause it in time, but I can't prevent it from falling completely. How about there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good, good, good. Okay. 
Now we jump. Oh, come on. Get on the ladder, though. I can't go from the glider to the ladder. I thought that was a thing we've done before. I could have sworn we've done that before. I could have sworn. Oh, okay. I got interrupted there, but still... I got interrupted because the ladder was right there. So we're close. And this is definitely not the intended path at all. Oh, see, it. See, I get interrupted because the ladder's there, but then Link goes, Wait a minute, the ladder's not right in front of me, it's off to my right! Ah! Yeah, okay, that's fine. We the, whoops, not that way. Oh, no, same, same deal, same deal. Oh, you know what? Totally forgot about Ascent. That's right, we build this, and so it actually stands up. I might get the height, hold on. Let me, um, detach. You. Because if it actually stands up, which I believe it was doing before, yeah, 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 okay, so we can stand it, like, over here. And then I can send up to it. Okay. I'm kind of surprised this is working. Holy shit. That did it. <laughs> Ascend! It's the one trick you always forget. Okay, Construct Bow. Can I carry- why can't I carry more? I thought I had- Okay, this one's about to break anyway, so go ahead and drop this one. Better bow we're replacing it with. Okay, there we go. That was a lot less complicated than I needed to make it. Like, the ball was the easy part, though. Which is kind of surprising. That's funny, there's a ramp right here. Oh, probably because they wanted you to carry... I don't know. It doesn't really matter. It's all good. We got it done. That's the important thing. Hey, folks, please give me my prize. I think this is number four. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so more endurance for me. Thanks for healing me up. Appreciate it. I did use up a lot of health there trying to get that thing to work. Okay, so more endurance for me. It's not quite enough to handle Zelda just yet. We'll get there. Okay, I have another marker. Yeah, okay, right down here. So just over this mountain. I say just over, like it's easy to get to. But it's alright, we'll get there. And actually, those trees seem suspiciously like Korok trees. Like maybe there's some... Korok nonsense going on over there is a waterfall over there, which is kind of cool. Try we need a Staminoka bass at some point. We've got to look at our side quest too. I've been kind of just going all over the place, but we've got definitely some good stuff for our side quests that can be done, like pretty easily. Just need to actually focus and do them. Like there's a couple of the, I think there's a couple of the musicians for the great fairies that we could probably locate already. And I'm sure there's other side quests that we can do. Now oh, there's an Octorok in there. Oh, and a Korok ring for sure. All right, if I go inside the Korok ring, that's definitely going to uh, proc a Korok. Also proc the Octorok. What are you going to do about that? I didn't proc the Korok, but you know. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I can't attack the Korok. What I can do, though, is switch over to my Zora gear, so I can swim with the waterfall. He's gonna hit me, just the way it goes. Yep, that's okay. Okay, time with the waterfall, thank you. And I don't get the Arctorok revenge, but that's alright. 
herbs here, some more Hyrulean herb. I'm kind of surprised that wasn't a Korok thing, though. Not sure what else that could have been. Right, we are near the Zora Temple, so there should be... Oh, there's actually a wind thing right here. That took me high up. Oh, and there's Addison again. Hey, Addison. It's been a while since I've done an Addison thing. It's a weird place for a sign, Addison. Don't, not sure I agree with that. Okay, there's the shrine over there. And you have no building materials here at all, do you? And why are you doing this without building materials, my dude? Alright, well, there's the rocks. We can use the rocks. We've done that before. Mm, don't know if that's going to work, but we can try it. That's ah, too holy. Trying to put it, like, directly underneath the sign so that it, it kind of protects it there, but I don't know. I don't know. Do it on both sides. And, like, attach them, I guess. I don't know if that's going to help. Addison, do you want to try this? Okay. Try letting go. Let's see what happens. Okay. I guess we're good. Two stones worked. I don't know why you want to sign here, but that was the easiest sign we've done so far. Okay, great. So you're going to go ahead and give me some food and some money. Thanks for the 20 rupees. Appreciate it. Not quite up to 4,000 yet. Extra balls there, and we get a puff shroom. Thank you. Alright, Addison's off. We can go to the other shrine. Let's do it. Oh, well, that's definitely a Korok thing. That seems like an easy one, too. We should be able to move that stone, complete the circle, and be good to go. Okay. Place it right over here. Done. No worries. You're welcome. Oh, hello there, guys. And poop. Oh, God. No worries. Uh, traveler sword? Oh, I can't pick any more weapons. Another weapon's up. Okay. Well, so much for that. We'll take the fangs. Thank you very much. And then away I go. Yes, I can tell, game. There's a shrine. It's right in front of me. My eyes have not yet failed me. It's like a stable, too, which I don't think we've actually been to yet. But of course, the shrine should be first, so we have a teleportation point. Okay, what do we got here? Hopefully a nice, easy puzzle. Or maybe combat. Combat shrine, you know, we haven't seen that in a while. Combat training. Okay. Archery time. Hopefully they're going to give me a lot of arrows. No arrows given there, but we'll see. All right. What do we need to do? Give me the instruction, please. Okay. Heed my instruction. I will try. Fire at the enemy's head. All right. Is that it? Okay. Do headshots. That's what I tried to do anyway. So this actually goes to my place of my strength. So that's great. So because apparently I should have done this one way earlier because this is just fighting with a bow. There you go. All right. Now they're going to make him move and stuff, right? I always got to do, I think, usually rule three, right? Oh, now he's got friends. All right. Do not fear the approaching enemies. Fire trees, strike their heads. Okay, thank you. They're actually going to approach or... Okay, okay, he's out. He's out. He's out. No worries. 
Easy. It's not even three times. Well, that was it? Okay, well that was dead simple. Kinda wish they dropped arrows though. Like where do they manifest their arrows? Did they just pull them out of the ether? Got a Zonite sword, which I'm a little tempted by. I uh, the construct bow is gonna be like level five or something. I don't want a crappy bow. Yeah, just regular construct bows. The Zonite sword's kind of cool. But yeah, just regular construct bows are not gonna do it. Oh, there's our arrows. Okay, thank you for those. Appreciate that. It's definitely more arrows than I used. Yeah, I'd like to do Zonite swords. Um, let me go ahead and trade out our weapons here. So I don't need these sticks. Let's drop these sticks. I can pick up the two Zonite Swords and fuse them with something. It doesn't actually matter what. Another Zonite Sword over here. There is another one. Okay, then I'll have to... You know, this thing's on its way out. It's given me a few warnings about this already. Let's go ahead and drop that and pick up this. Okay, so we should probably fuse them right now. Otherwise, I'm going to forget. I'm going to pull the Zonite Sword and go, This is crappy. Yeah, because it's only six, obviously. We need to combine it with something. So, sort by fuse power. All right, 27 fuse power. I mean, diamonds is something. Let's go, let's do some diamonds. Do some construct horns. All right, let's actually do two of those and a diamond. That sounds great. Let's do this. Then give me those Zonite swords. And let's go ahead and fuse you. There we go. Okay, 34. That's pretty good. And fuse you. Thank you. And then finally, go over here. And fuse you. Okay. We've got us some awesome weapons now. That's great. Gonna give me another weapon here. That'd be kind of hilarious. Mighty Construct Bow. Um, I kind of want that, though. 24. You know, I'll drop the I'll drop the five here. Drop the five. There we go. Thank you for the upgrade. Appreciate it. Alright, simple shrine. No worries. Yeah, that shrine totally played to my strengths. I mean, I usually try to hit headshots with a bow. And wouldn't you always try to do that? I mean, I guess the difference would be is if the enemy doesn't actually have a vulnerable head. Like any of the any of the flux constructs, for example, headshot totally wouldn't work because their heads aren't always going to be the vulnerable piece. Or um, I'm trying to think of another good example. I don't know. It seems like for most of the other enemies, like even Lynels, even probably Gleox, that we haven't actually tested that yet, um, all probably are vulnerable to headshots. Oh, it's about to be Blood Moon. Yep, it's Blood Moon time. Alright, well, it's about time to go ahead and end the episode anyway. So, for right now, thanks for watching. This has been Legend of Zelda Cheers of the Kingdom. I'm PC Universe here, PC Universe Cheers, and I'll see you guys next time.